Yo, what up? This is D Dog Will, and this is part two of how to track out your beat. So, the reason why I'm doing part two is that you see a gross beat on my master track. So, any effect, any effect that you have on your master track is not going to pick up the track out. So, what does that mean? That means that if you do have any effects on your master track, you have to track out one by one. So, I'm going to teach you how to do it. So, say all these right here, all these sounds right here are the sounds I use for my beat. So, I'm going to start from insert one. I have a clap in there. I don't know why it doesn't say clap one or whatever. Um, so, what you want to do is hold control and click right there. So, it turns off everything. Your master is still on. Your select is still on. So, what you want to do is go to File, Export, Wave. And I have an example folder. So, I'm going to put... That's the, that's going to be the name of the beat, example, or whatever. And then clap. So, go to save. Make sure your split mixer track is off. That's what you have to make sure. You have to make sure that it's off. And export. So, now, after you get that one out the way, you got to go to the next one. So, remember, hold, contr hold control click. You go to your next sound and go to export. Example, uh, I don't know what instrument this is. I'll just put hat. And that's pretty much how you do it. That's it. All you got to do is keep going. All you got to do is keep going all over here till you're done. You got to make sure that every track is used and you have to make sure every used track is exported so that's how you track out with effects on your master track make sure you subscribe to my youtube at d.will and um make sure you follow me on instagram and twitter at d.will everything d.will so i'll see y'all in a minute peace